thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and we're going to be looking at a new game called Northern Lights. Northern Lights is an open-world survival simulation set in the extreme conditions of the Arctic Tundra. Is it Arctic Tundra, or is it Siberia? I thought it was Siberia. I don't know. Maybe it's the same thing. I don't really know. I'm, I'm sure that Siberia is pretty close to the Arctic uh, Tundra. So uh, it, The game kind of reminds me of Green Hell, except cold. It's like a cold green hell. Uh, it, I played it for about an hour. I did a lot of fun with it. We're going to check it out. It is on Steam for $18. And thank you to the developers for sending me a key. All right, let's go to new game here. Uh, apparently, it's got cooperative, which is awesome. Uh, work together with friends. Oh, it's coming soon. Okay. All right, I, I'm glad I showed you that. Because if you just saw cooperative, you might have thought it was in the game right now. All right, so uh, we have a bunch of different kinds of uh, you know game difficulty settings. Uh, wanderer, peaceful wanderer in the world. Mother Nature will pose no threat. Um, for a new experience, players interested in thoughtful exploration. Finish your story at your own pace. I don't know if there's a story in the game yet. Uh, wildlife will not attack, and Mother Nature won't be a problem. Then there's resourceful. This is the one I this is the one I played on my test game, and it's you know it's it's kind of a little bit on the easy side. Uh, it says Mother Nature's elements are challenging, but the abundant resources make up for it. Wildlife will attack. Uh, will act territorial. All right, and we also have Survivor. At any point, Mother Nature's elements can make it can take a different twist. The unexpectable, the unexpectable becomes part of your journey. Okay, uh, for veteran players looking for a challenging survival experience, aggressive wildlife will hunt you down when you least expect it. Mother Nature's elements are bird some. Uh, yeah, okay, this is the one I want. By the way, we also have Prey, which is just you know jack everything up to the ultimate. <laughs> Uh, I will turn the tutorial off uh, because, you know, the tutorial was pretty helpful, but it got stuck at one point. I um I kind of did a fire and, like, I, I did something with the fire I wasn't supposed to do just yet. It didn't check in the tutorial, and the tutorial got stuck. So um, the tutorial is pretty handy, but, you know, if you're watching this video, you're not going to need it because I'm going to show you what it, what it tells you, at least as far as my understanding of the game goes. Don't forget, I only played for, like, an hour, so we will be finding out stuff together as well. All right, so it is Northern Siberia. All right. Okay, and here we are. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is pick up everything we can. Uh, the one thing I had problems with when I first started playing this game was I couldn't find rope. And rope is basically um, at the base of trees. It's like their roots. And that's what you use as rope. So I'm going to take all the mushrooms I can. Some mushrooms are good to eat. Some aren't. Uh, I kind of know which ones are good to eat. I, I, I think all the ones I had were good to eat. Except for one, which was kind of like a, um, I think it was like a white mushroom. I don't remember which one it was. Uh, when I ate it, though, it poisoned me. So, got to try and avoid that as best we can. So, we need a hatchet here. Um, we're going to take rocks. We're going to take all this stuff. We're going to take all the sticks we can find. Um, where are we on the map? Oh, this is a completely different map. Okay. I thought we would have spawned in the same spot each time. I don't think the world's procedurally generated, but I don't know. Maybe it is. Oh, uh, what do we have here? Tree log. All right, so what we're looking for at this point is rope, which is, again, is going to be, like, at the base of trees. It's going to be kind of like the roots. Here's some. No? Really? Okay. Kind of looked like it. Uh, yep, hatchet. So none there. Wait, something there? Nope. Oh, we got a wolf. Okay, we'll avoid that. Oh, there's a there's a building over there. Cool. I have not been in a building yet, so that's cool. Uh, there's also something, an animal over there. Oh, there's a wolf right there. Oh my god, there's freaking animals every- Well, I mean, that could be good and bad. Just depends on how things go. It's kind of hard to watch out for, um, hostile animals and look for rope at the same time. But it is- Oh, here we go. This is definitely some. Okay. There we go. So let's open this up. Go over here. I'll show you this stuff in more detail later when I'm not, like, you know, in serious danger. Okay, so now that we've got that, we got to start thinking about a campfire. And for campfires, we're going to need sticks. We're going to chop down trees. But I'd like to kind of get over... Uh, it looks like a boar. I'd like to kind of get over here to that, like, um, to that building over there. It looks kind of like a barn. And it would be really nice to have a place to stay. Um, staying out in the cold is not ideal, obviously. All right, we're going to chop down a tree as well. You just press E once, you chop down the tree, you drop the logs, and then you um, right-click, harvest, uh, right-click, harvest, right-click, harvest. 
All right, so... Oh, these these are the good mushrooms. Yeah, these yellow mushrooms have some kind of medicinal things to them. I think I cured a fever with them. Uh, when I got sick on the on the uh, the bad mushrooms, I ended up... um, I ended up getting... Uh, what did I get? I got food poisoning. And the food poisoning, you can't cure. It's just got to cure over time. Uh, but when you have food poisoning, it gives you a chance to um, get... Oh, look at this. Uh, when you have food poisoning, it gives you a chance to get a fever. And those yellow mushrooms did cure the fever. And I didn't have to make them into a, like, stew or anything. They just kind of cured it just by eating them. All right, let's check this place out. All right, looks pretty good to me. Oh, we got some milk. Love it. All right, the first thing I want to do is, is uh, save the game. Now, normally I'd make a bed out of sticks. You can make, like, um, a stick bed, right? But I might not need to do that because there should be a bed in here. Sleep. Okay. Now you might be thinking, Cage, what the hell are you sleeping for? Well, I'm sleeping because that's how I saved the game. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. Okay. So I think the next thing we're going to want to do is make a fire. Do you want to make a fire in the bedroom? I, I think that kind of makes sense. Can I pick these up? I wish I could pick those up. I can't store anything in here. I can make my own storage things. So not really that big of a deal. Uh, I don't really love that bedroom. Let's see if there's a oh, bathroom. We got another bedroom over here. Uh, yeah, it's like a kid's room. I'm an adult, damn it. All right, I guess we'll just stay in here. All right, so let's go ahead and make a fire. And I don't think you can, like, burn anything down. <laughs> but not really not really 100% on that. So let's go ahead and craft a fire. Oh, you can't put it inside? Oh, I wonder if there's a fire you can put it. Well, maybe I can't put it upstairs. All right, this is the only fire I can make right now. Right, yep. You get more blueprints as you level up. Okay, well, let's see where we can make this fire, then. Maybe I can make it on the first floor. Alright, I'm already getting cold. Uh, there we go. Okay. Maybe it just can't be near walls or something. Let me try. I'm going to try and... Eh, whatever. Eh, no, not whatever. Because I, I, I definitely want the fire where I'm going to be sleeping. Let's see if, if we can't... If we don't put it near walls. Yeah, there's nowhere to put it up here. Alright, fine. Uh, what about over here? Nope. Uh, yeah, I, I don't think it could be on the second floor. Maybe, I don't know. I'm not really sure. Uh, we'll just make it right... Can I sleep on this couch? Uh, no, I can't. Okay. So I'm not gonna have a fire where I sleep, which is a bit of a... Which is a bit of a bummer, but... I don't know. I think we'll be okay. Maybe. Uh, seems like a good spot for it. And you build it with sticks. Uh, if you hold down T, you bring up your watch. And... I'm getting pretty cold, but not seriously cold just yet. Um, I do want this fire to be going. Uh, the spruce bark, you right-click on that and harvest it, and you get tinder. Okay. And then if you right-click on the firewood and harvest, you get more sticks. You need a lot of sticks. See? I'm already out of sticks. These are all my sticks are. Well, that's where they would be if I had any. Okay. There we go. And then you put the tinder in here. And we also have to make a fire starter. So the fire starter will be a uh, hand drill. There we go. Okay. All right, we're good to go for fire starter. Oh, you know what? I don't think I can boil snow if I make a fire out here. Oh, that could be a problem. We'll have to see. Um, when I played my test game, uh, I built in the snow. And I'm going to go save my game. Uh, I built in the snow. And, like, you could just boil water right out of snow uh, using a can. Right? As a matter of fact, let's put the recycled can down here cooking spot the fire is not the same thing as the cooking spots so like you got to click on the cooking spot in order to put stuff well on the cooking spot so there we go let's put that right there uh oh we can melt snow okay maybe i think the idea is you don't really have to go far to get it so it's a big deal right all right cool so let's go up and save the game and uh we'll go ahead and do some more exploring uh, while i can i mean i'm not going to come inside until i start getting really cold all right, let's go do some more gathering and exploring while we have the time. It is... Uh, 13, uh, 1500 is 3 p.m., right? Yeah, I think so. All right, cool. Let's look around. See what we can find. Chop down some trees. Little gazebo over here. Oh, can I turn that into firewood? Salvage? Oh, sticks. Okay, cool. I'm not going to need chairs. It's still on the floor. No big deal. Uh, ooh, cooking pot. Hell yeah. This is a really nice find. Uh, furniture, salvage. Wow. 
Yeah, this game's pretty cool, man. I'm, having, I'm actually pretty excited about it. When I first heard about it, I was like, oh, you know, it, it seems pretty interesting. And I looked at it, and I was like, okay, I'll take a look at it. And this is like, I don't know, like a month or two ago. And I, I was like, you know, whatever. Um, it's locked. Find a key. And then I was like, you know, whatever. And then I um, I looked at it today, and I, I got to be honest with you guys, I didn't expect much. But this is really, I mean, it's early access. So I don't know at what point. It will be like, okay, you know, it's kind of, it needs work here, it needs work there. I mean, you know, these early access games work. But um, I gotta, I'm gotta, i just going to say I'm pleasantly surprised at what I've been playing so far. Uh, Harvest. I mean, you might say, well, okay, you know, just copy of Green Hell. Well, it's not really because Green Hell is is hot and this one's cold. Or, you know, Green Hell can be cold, I guess. But totally different like setups. And that's really interesting. So, at least I think it's interesting. Am I overweight or anything? Yep, I am. Right, let's go drop some stuff off in the house. This is not a good sign. <laughs> I'm just making a mess everywhere. Uh, probably not a good idea. That's okay, though. Well, uh, I'll organize it. But I I'd rather organize it during the night. Why waste daytime inside? You know, when I'm probably going to be inside all night anyway. Okay. How do I get... I probably got to find the key in the house. Should I, go Should I make a beeline for getting the barn... Or should I... Cut? I'm going to cut down some more trees. Actually, yeah, let's cut down some more trees. I'd really like to not, like, run out of wood during the night. That would be awesome. Uh, okay, i got to actually take out the hatchet. Plus, my hatchet's going to break soon. I'm going to need more rope, too. Oh, it sounds like it's getting bad out here. Damn it. Right-click harvest. Right-click harvest. Right-click harvest. Pick up the sticks. All right, so it's getting really cold. Oh, my inventory's full. How full, though? How much did I miss? Yeah, I missed quite a few sticks. Okay, that's fine. Uh, let's take a look. Uh, we're still okay for now. For the time being. And I'm going to look around back, see what we got out here. You know, I should, if I can't carry sticks, I should probably go drop sticks off. Oh, okay, hold on. All right, that didn't look good. All right, let's 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 start the let's start the fire. The hell with it. All right, so do we have to put wood on there first? Nope. Already wood on there. Oh, that's right. I need tinder. Wait, where's the tinder? I already put tinder on there. Hmm. I wonder if I put the tinder and then... No, I don't know. I guess the tinder doesn't stay on there. So you can't just put the tinder on there and leave it. Alright, there we go. I got fire starting one, which is cool. This would be a good time to take a look at the stats, I guess. Alright, so let's take a look at everything. These are my quests. Scout the main location of the island to find clues. This is when I pick up stuff. I've got unknown berries. Uh, there's two things. There's two things on each of these. There's eating them, and then there's putting them in a stew. All right. Uh, these. Hmm. I'm not sure about these red mushrooms. I think these red mushrooms are bad. These chaga mushrooms are okay. These black ones, I think, are okay. These are okay. So, there we go. All right, and then look at what we got here. So that's uh, afflictions. Okay. I guess you have to get them first. Then you've got skills. So you've got archery, increases damage, reduces stamina usage, um, increases harvesting yield for butchering, cooking, crafting, fire starting, reduces stamina usage, reduces tool wear. All right, cool, cool. Uh, we've got notes, which I have none yet. These are all the stuff I can craft. I'm not sure what you need the stone knife for yet. Probably skinning. Uh, we need a, got a torch there, a stick spear, we should probably make a stick spear. Uh, fishing tackle? Oh, okay. I'm missing requirements for all this stuff, but... Uh, Hanjo, uh, crafted bedone. Um, I should probably try and go outside and get some rope before nighttime if I can. Uh, this is the campfire. I don't know about that unknown blueprint just yet. Um, snare trap. Oh, I can make that. Stone rope. Oh, no, I need rope for that. That's right. It's, I can put down the ghost image, but I can't make it yet. All right, so we got a snare trap. Um, I don't know what the difference between the bed and the shelter. Maybe this gives you better sleep. I, I don't know. Um, roof shelter, small shelter. And then right here we have holders. Okay, so the holders are what I want. We're going to need a stick holder. Oh, we need a lot of rope for that. Okay. Yeah, we should probably try and go, try and go out and get some rope. Oh, we need cloth for storage boxes. Dude, where do I get cloth from? I'll bet you I have to, I have to kill animals for that. All right. Uh, also, keep your fire going as much as you can. Uh, because Tinder is not that easy to find. Okay. So we're going to drop this, 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 
That, although I seem to have a lot of tinder, so I don't know. Maybe it's not as hard to find as I thought. All right, let's go ahead and get some more stuff while we have the you know the little bit of daylight we have. The storm's over, so I'm gonna go out here and I'm going. I, no, no, no. I'm gonna save the game first. I'm gonna save the damn game first. Best believe that. I'll search for the key at night. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna save the game. It's just doesn't make any sense not to. I wish there was a separate save option so you didn't have to actually go into the bed. That would be cool. I'm probably gonna have to make a torch at night. Can I? Uh, if I want to, if I want to look around the house at night, I'm probably gonna need a torch. What did that take? Oh, just sticks and rope. Okay. Yeah, I really need to get some rope for real. All right, so let's go out here and look for some rope around the trees. Yeah, even the whole idea of getting rope from trees is very green hell. All right, you can usually see the trees with the rope from relatively far away. There we go. I don't know what the hell pine cones are for. I could be like Gandalf and light them on fire and throw them at orcs. But are there orcs in this game? Oh, that'd be dope. Something tells me there's no orcs in this game. I think I've got a lot of wood. I, I'm pretty sure I've got a lot of wood. I'm, well, <laughs> I was going to not get any wood out here, but whatever. If I just chop, chop down a tree, I might as well. Harvest. Harvest. Damn it. I wonder if the rope grows back. I hope so. Grab some more rope there. So I just saw a rabbit over here. And I noticed I could throw my spear. Oh god. <laughs> yeah, that's about what I would throw a spear like in real life. Damn it. Alright, I'm just going to try and chase him. Oh, there he goes. So you can get a lot closer to him than I thought you could. Let's see if I can uh, track him down again. Oh, what is that? Salvage, hell yeah. I need some more sticks, bro. Mm, I probably should have marked my base, but it's pretty obvious right there, so... Not a big deal. Alright, let's see if we can duck and get closer to this guy. Oh, I got him! Beautiful. Wait. Did I get him? <laughs> okay, he just kind of stood there. Maybe I hit him in the leg or something. Uh, all right, um, hatchet or knife required. Okay, I don't. Well, can I make a knife right now? If I can make a knife right now, I'll use a knife. The knife's got to be better, right? Yeah, I don't have what I need for it. Whatever. Oops. E. I would imagine you get more stuff with the knife because it's a more you know delicate tool for skinning. But eh, I don't know. Whoa, negative five five sanity for killing a freaking rabbit? Seriously? Freaking pansy. You get... Wait, where's my axe? Oh, my axe broke. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, alright. I need to get some more stone. One thing I have been ignoring is stone. That's not good. We're gonna have to go home pretty soon. I am getting hungry and thirsty, which, you know. Uh, you know, I should probably go home and see if I can boil snow or not, because I don't really know if I can. Although, there's, there's food and drink in that house. Probably won't be a big deal. All right, we definitely need uh, another hatchet. And let's also get a stone knife. All right, so you can put these things in different places. Um, oh, I like where that is. Spears number one, hatchet's number two, knife's number three. Okay, uh, how are we doing out here? I mean, we're doing all right. I mean, I keep thinking I should go inside, but no, I, I guess not. I'll just keep, I keep staying out here and getting resources. Make the most of the day, right? Got some wild berries there. So what I could do is I could save the game, eat stuff to see what it does, and then reload. You know, I might do that. We'll see. Oh, this guy's stuck, isn't he? Yeah. All right, so it seems like the rabbits are getting stuck, which is kind of unfortunate. But let's see how the butchering goes with this thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. Um, oh, they sanity these because of bad weather, not because of the rabbits. Oh, Okay. All right, let's see if we can get this guy legit. Okay, I guess we can't. Well, at least they're not moving. Yeah, like I said, early access. <laughs> uh, knife. Yeah, I'm getting negative because of the bad weather. Is that what I butchered that rabbit? Was it because of the bad weather? Or was it because of the rabbit? Butchering. Yeah, I think it was because of the bad weather. I don't know why butchering a rabbit would bother you. 
All right, we are encumbered. Let's get back to base. So let's go ahead and put some more wood in this fire. I'd like to keep it going. What is that? Oh, rabbit pelts. Okay. Oh, I couldn't hold all the rabbit pelts. All right. Interesting. That is interesting. Okay, so can we cook stuff? Let's go ahead and cook some stuff. Uh, we've got raw rabbit meat. Stuff can burn. So you got to keep an eye on it. Now, can we make like rabbit stew? See, all you got to do is press space bar. And I think the idea is you just kind of peek your head outside, grab some snow, and then come in and, you know, you're good to go. And that rhymes, don't you know? All right, so I think these white mushrooms are okay. I don't remember what mushrooms are, are good or what's not. I'm pretty sure these white mushrooms are okay. I just don't know about the other ones. All right, so that is still cooking. All right, this is good. Let's see if we can make some stew. Ah, I can't make rabbit stew, huh? That's a shame. All right, can we make uh, chaga stew? Yeah, I remember one of these things I can make stew with. Oh, maybe blueberry stew as well. I didn't want to say two because it rhymes. Okay, so let's take a look here. And we're going to need... Uh, what do we need first? Rock holders? Log holders? I don't know. Probably firewood holders. Where do you get firewood holders from? All right, there we go. And rabbit meat cooked. And we're going to cook up another one. All right, then we're going to take a look at this. Um, I think I can make a bedone. To, to get that, but I'm just gonna go ahead and cons well, maybe I should get a bedon. I don't know, whatever. Let's just eat the ra let's eat the rabbit meat. Oh, it's got two days. All right, we'll, we'll we'll be good on the rabbit meat for a while. Consume this. Twenty high. Oh, that doesn't even give you any anything uh, as far as food goes. All right, so let's take a look at the stats now. Yeah, we need food. All right, consume. Eighty two hunger. Holy moly, I am freaking stuffed. That filled me up in a big way. All right, melt some more snow. Yeah, so we're going to be good on food for uh, for a few days. All right, so we got firewood. So is there a, um, a thing for firewood? Uh, rock, logs, stick, rope, pelts. Oh, pelt curing. Yeah, I, I need that. Does it have to go outside? Probably has to go outside. I mean, it makes sense that it would go outside. We're just going to kind of open this door back here. And we're going to put... I don't know where you put firewood, though. Rope. There we go. No, not rope. Damn it, Cage. What? There we go. That's what we want. Uh, Why can't I put it there? Oh, man. It would go so cool on this porch. Damn it. Can it be inside? All right. I guess I'll just put it inside. I I don't like putting it inside because the idea is the wind won't get to it. And if, it, if the wind doesn't get to it, how is it supposed to, you know, how is it supposed to dry things? But whatever. All right, let's get this off before it burns. And it's burnt. Okay. Well, there you go. I told you you could burn meat. Uh, should I do something with this? Or I guess I'll hold on to it for now. All right. So we got some water. And I think water is what we need next. Why don't we go ahead and make some... I don't want to be experimenting with this freaking stuff. Uh, what about blueberries? Blueberries can't be bad, right? Uh, I can't make anything with any of these anyway. Alright, so we're just going to cook this. And we're going to finish this. Uh, what do we need for this? What am I missing? Rope and sticks? Am I really missing rope? Dude, I, I got a ton of rope out there. I wonder if my inventory was full and I didn't actually get all that rope. No, I've got lots of rope on me. What the hell? Maybe I need the sticks? Well, I got this thing built, and I'm going to put the rabbit pelts on it. There we go. Looks like you got two spots only, which is fine. And then I'm going to come over here. I did make a stick holder, and I put a bunch of sticks in there. Um, I'm not sure where you're supposed to store firewood. I don't see any firewood holder. Uh, maybe I'll get one eventually. I did notice this salting spot, though. So what I'm going to do is, can I salt my burnt meat? Oh, dude, if I could salt my burnt meat into, into like, salted meat, that'd be so freaking dope. Okay, it's still burnt. Rabbit meat. Okay, so let's try and salt the rabbit meat cooked. Because I'm just kind of curious. I'd imagine I don't have any salt, so this shouldn't be doing anything, but I don't know. Okay, that doesn't look like it did anything either. Maybe it's got to be raw. Rabbit meat cooked. Oh, that decay went up to four days. Wasn't it less than that? I think it was less than that. I thought it was like two days once it was cooked, although I don't really know for sure. 
Okay. Uh, the next thing I want to do is continue salvaging stuff. Uh, cooking pot's fine there. Uh, furniture. Hatch do, I wanna, do I care about the furniture? What am I going to get from it that I really care about? Okay, spruce bark is fine. Uh, wait, is this working? Is this thing actually working? Oh, you can't put meat in there? That's weird. It's a refrigerator. What the hell else would I put in there? Uh, let's put the burnt meat in there. No, you can't even do that, right? Uh, what can I put in there? Can we put, um... Uh, let's see if we can put firewood. No, I'm not sure what you're supposed to be able to put in there. Oh, blackberry juice? Wait, what? You can only put blackberry juice? Okay, that's kind of weird. Um, alright. So, here we go. We got some water. Uh, water will be fine. I think it might be time to take a nap. I want to see what else I can salvage. I'm going to just salvage everything, right? Sticks. Oh, we got a book! Oh. Book. Harvest. Paper! Uh, you know what? I think that's probably going to be good for tender. Oh, storage. Here we go. Okay, you know what I need? I need cloth. Oh, I see. There was something in the refrigerator. Oh, okay. Alright, my bad. There we go. Okay, cool. Alright, is there anything I get cloth in here? That's what I really need. I need cloth. Do I have any more sticks? I do. Let's put some sticks in here. And let's see if there's any... Why can't I salvage this stuff for cloth? Ooh, a hat. Uh... Oh, it's me switching them out. Okay. So, I had a cotton toque, and now I have a hat. Can I move that without... Can, can't you move, like, take more harvest? Um, take... So, can I only... Wait, can I carry stuff in my inventory? Like, can, can I carry clothes in my inventory? Because that seems a little weird that you can't carry clothes with you. Alright, see what else we got up here. Salvage... Um, sticks, a uh, bed, we got food, I'm gonna leave that there for now. Ooh, pillow. Cloth? Cloth? Yes! I need four cloth, though, for a storage container. Uh, what's in here? What is that? Oh, rice. Okay. So I, I think I could store stuff in those storage containers, but it's it, probably not a lot of stuff, I'd imagine. Alright, let's look in here. All right, we got some uh, some more rice, a parka, which is better defense but less it slows me down or what? I think it slows me down. Fleece jacket. All right, I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with the parka. I guess defense does seem a little bit better. Mm -hmm. Take that. Salvage that for sticks and cloth. Okay, cool. <gasps> Map piece? Ooh! But what... Do I have to, like, use it or something? Map piece. That's cloth. Uh... I don't know where the map piece would have gone. Yeah, it's kind of weird. It said map piece, but no nothing's opened up. It might be in my inventory somewhere. Alright, I'll look for it later. Okay. That's all we can do here. This is going to be my base. I don't see any reason to go anywhere else, honestly. At least not like to live. Ooh, a hatchet. Hell yeah. I'll take that later. Feathers. Uh, Blackberry juice. Okay. Cool. Alright, guys. Let's go to sleep. And Oh, hold on. Yeah, I got more stuff over there. I'd like to make a storage container before I actually go to sleep. We could do that in the morning. Yeah, let's do that in the morning. I'm actually going to call this one here, guys. We'll make a storage container in the morning. Uh, we'll go to sleep, pass the night, and then we'll go out and do some more exploring. If you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. I noticed about half of you guys watching my videos on the reg are not subscribed, and that's cool. I get it. But it really, really helps the channel if you subscribe, so I hope I have earned your subscription today. If you guys want to see more of this game, make sure you let me know in the comments. Let me know with the like button, all that good stuff. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.